55% of Duncanville ISD's more than 12,000 students are learning virtually this year due to the pandemic. And roughly 100 of those virtual learners have been struggling to connect with the classroom. So today, teachers and district leaders masked up and gloved up going door to door to help reconnect with those struggling students. To have the opportunity to go knock on doors and to get them to re-engage is just exciting. Today's outreach effort was called Operation Connection, focused on meeting with students and families face to face to see what issues are hindering the students' ability to connect with the classroom. It's really difficult in the virtual learning environment. Some students don't have connectivity, some students are sharing devices with siblings, and so when you have those challenges, it's really hard to stay active in your academics. Duncanville Superintendent Dr. Mark Smith says failure rates are 10 percentage points higher during the pandemic and students struggling the most are learning online. The digital divide is definitely more impactful in lower socioeconomic communities. And so I think that it's a call for all of us to figure out how we can change that. Uh, because a kid or a student's zip code should not have an impact on how they're able to access connectivity and learn through that uh, modem. So district staffers hit the pavement to see what steps they could take to identify and overcome the hurdles that their students are facing. And so we need to get out and reconnect with them and see what we can do to help them get reengaged to learn about what their challenges are and then just to provide whatever they need to get back active into school. At the end of the day, I just hope that our community sees just how much we care and how much we want to be present and collaborate and have that strong partnership with all of our families and with the community. And I want to see our scholars engage in school. The district says they will be following up with the students and their families to ensure that they have the devices, the internet access, and any other resources they need to be able to reconnect with their schools.